Alright oh, guys, it is a spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times in paradise somewhere in a secret location outside of uh, Ocala, Florida here on this gorgeous Monday morning in the end times. That would be February 11th, 2019. So we have a leaky roof to deal with today, but before I dive into the leaky roof, I need to uh, do what I do every day, and this is going to be a short and sweet, we are so fucked, uh, doomsday headline of the day. Uh, I, I love it when we have new polls, so I guess this is not, this is, uh, this new poll not just in the United States. This is a global poll. Good Lord, how do you poll 7.6 billion people? But anyway, this new poll numbers are in. What do you think is named as the top threat on the planet, according to the planet's citizenry? Uh, it would be climate change has now made it to the number one threat facing this planet, the number one. I do not believe it. Uh, climate change seen as the top threat, but U.S. power, U.S. power is a growing worry to the, uh, I guess, the rest of the planet. Okay, <clears throat> take it away. Reuters news. Climate change is the top security concern in a poll conducted by the Washington-based Pew Research Center followed by Islamist terrorism. Okay, number one, climate change. Number two, Islamist terrorism and cyber attacks. While respondents in a growing number of countries worried about the power and influence of the United States. Well, they're not going to have to worry about that for much longer because the power and influence of the United States is in full collapse mode. Okay, so I guess they, they polled people in 26 countries and in 13 of those, so exactly half of the 26 countries, people listed climate change as the top global threat with the Islamic State Militant Group topping the list in eight countries and cyber attacks in four countries. The nonprofit, nonpartisan Pew Research Center said in its report, worries about climate change have increased sharply since 2013 with double-digit percentage point increases seen in countries including the United States, Mexico, France, Britain, South Africa, and Kenya, according to the poll of 27,612 people conducted last summer. Uh, North Korea's nuclear program and the global economy were also significant concerns while respondents in Poland named Russian power and influence as the top threat. No shit, Sherlock. The largest shift in sentiment centered in, centered on the United States with a median of 45 percent of people, you know, outside the U.S., naming <clears throat> U.S. power and influence as a threat up from 25% in 2013 when Barack Obama was president. In 10 countries, including Germany, Japan, and South Korea, roughly half of respondents or more saw U.S. power and influence as a major threat to their nation up from eight in 2017 and three countries in 2013. In Mexico, where those concerns have spiked since the election of U.S. President Donald Trump, the percentage jumped to 64 percent. 
the poll showed. Trump has railed against illegal migration and the North American Free Trade Agreement and is pressing to build a wall between the two countries. In 2018, a median of 61% of all respondents across all countries represented viewed cyber attacks as a serious concern up from 54% in 2017 and the number of countries that saw Islamic State as a threat fell by double digit percentage points in Israel, Spain, Japan, and the United States. So I guess them Muslims, them Muslims are going down as a threat. Donald Trump and climate change are coming up as the biggest threats to the planet. That is nowhere mentioned anywhere in that story was the insect apocalypse being a threat to the planet. Not sure how many respondents voted that, but uh, I'm going to wrap up this uh, We Are So Fucked headline. And since I'm always looking for the word collapse in headlines, we're going to go over to Collapse Chronicles over to The Guardian and read Plummeting Insect Numbers Threaten the Collapse of Nature. But we're going, you're going to have to go over to Collapse Chronicles to hear, to hear that. Meanwhile, smoke them if you got them, and we all know why. Bye, guys.